This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Who what's up people? Dobson Wolves is right here and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! Pack Ring and today our episode we are continuing the road to Tokyo Japan as you guys know I'm not there just yet as this video is being uploaded it's because of course this is February and I'll be going in March. So, the road to Japan. We're going to continue and open up a Yu Gi Oh! Speed Duel GX Midterm Paradox. One of my absolute favorite Speed Duel boxes. I love the Paradox Brothers. I love Gate Guardian. This is an amazing box, folks. It's really, really good. So, in one of these boxes. Oh my god, right from the very get go, I just saw one of the great cards in here. You get yourself, of course. A lovely playmat. You don't really want to look at this playmat because it's quite huge. So I'm going to put that to the side. If you guys want to look at that up, you can definitely look it up on the internet. But you get yourself quite a lot of decks, just to be honest, in this one little tiny box. And it absolutely is an amazing. <laughs> excuse me. Woo. <laughs> excuse me. Woo. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. <laughs> so, out of one little display box. You get yourself 100 common cards ready to play speed duel decks with 12 new skill cards, 4 of the 12 secret rare variant cards. So, yeah, there's 12 secret rares to collect in this set, but I've already got like quite a few more already, so I'm almost close. Uh, how many decks is there? So, you get yourself an Elemental Hero deck, a H2O deck, a Roy deck, a Gate Guardian deck. That is really, really good, people. That's 4 decks right there. And you get a lot, a lot of additional spe additional monsters and additional skill cards for all the decks. So let's go ahead and crack these open and let's see what this deck really consists of. I can't find the cellophane. There it is. So yeah, this structure deck, well, structure deck or build and battle, if you want to call it that, for Speed Duel is one of the best, I think. So right here we have ourselves some Roid cards. We've got Cycle Roid, Gyroid. Steamroid, Drillroid, UFO Roid, which is good to come back. We've got the Hound, Express Roid, Ambulance Roid, Submarine Roid, Stealth Roid, another good card there. Truck Roid, Rescue Roid, Mixer Roid, which is good because we didn't get that back in the day, thankfully, we've now got it. Weapon Change, Shield Crush, the Vehicle Roid, Connection Zone, Twister, Supercharge, Wonder Garge, um, M. Emergeroid Call, Steam Gyroid, Super Vehicle Roid Jumbo Drill, Ambulance Rescue Roid, Super Vehicle Roid Stealth Union, and that is the Cyrus deck. That is great deck, people. It really is. Then we have one of my absolute favourite decks. We got Gate Guardian, Labyrinth Wall, Crass Clown, Dream Clown. Gumo, Shadow Ghoul, which is one of my absolute favourite cards. We've got Sanji, Lord of the Thunder, Kaijin, and Suijin. Stone Statue of Azelf, Ryu Kaijin Clown, Seahorse Kaiser, the Av Angular, we have the Whirlwind Prodigy, Soul Exchange, Fairy Meteor, Tribute Doll, Double Summon, Judgment of Anubis, Eleventh of Nightmare, that is insane. <laughs> Literally, people, them decks are ridiculous. These are the skill cards, if you guys want to know. And out of all of them, I'll tell you which one is my absolute favourite. We've got Hero Unites Fusion. We've got Chemistry in Motion. The Roads are alright. Behold Gate Guardian, that's my favourite. Under Pressure, Chilling Outback, Hero World, Power Bond, Beware the Brothers Paradox, that's another great one. Uh, Earth, Thunder, Water, Wind. You can tell me I'm very, very biased, people. The um, Paradox Brother cards are super powerful. And if you guys want to play with Gate Guardians, these are the ones you want. They are super good. The next one we're going to open up here, before we open up the little sleeve of secrets that we can pull. I hope we can do pull some good secrets, people. <laughs> From the first one that I just saw, though, it's definitely worth it. So we got ourselves Avion, Bustinatrix, Clayman, Sparkman, we've got the Third Eye, Green Karibo, Catapulta, Bubble Man, Blade Edge, Wild Heart, Blazeman, thank god, which is great, Polymerization, Heated Heart, Righteous Justice, Skyscraper 2, not a very good Skyscraper card, prefer the original, A Hero Lives, 
We've got Hero Signal, Hero Ring, Counter Attack. We've now got Tempest in Speedjol, which is super powerful. We've got Electrum, which is not too bad. Wild Wingman is a good supporter, and Marina is the worst one. Don't use this card. Uh, Nova, Nova Master, very powerful card as well. And that is another and that's hero deck that, that you can build. Now we have the H2O cards. We've got Water Dragon, Ryu, Hydreigon, Hydrogedon, Oxygedon, uh, Protops, Inuagion, I don't remember them. We got Carbonadon. We've now got a Kaiju in Speed Duel, ladies and gentlemen. This card is so good if you want to go into professional playing when you're playing Sk um, Speed Duel. Kaijus is a must. Water Dragon Cluster, Dortrion, two of them. And literally the spell cards for that deck. Living Fossil, finally getting into Speed Duel. Des Koala for some weird reason. We got Pika Pew. We got Des Wombat. Frost and Flame Dragon, Sea Koala, we got the Storm Serpent, and some more hero cards for the support, UFO Roid Fighter, and Necroid Shaman. This box, people, is super good if you want to build a very powerful speed, you know, powerful altogether uh, speed duel deck. But, what do we get out of the secret rare variant cards? And like I said, people, a lot of people say, oh, speed card, speed duel cards, they don't worth money. Excuse me, people, they really do. The um, tournament packs are worth a fortune, people. It's serious. And there is our first one right there. Elemental Hero Bubble Man in a secret rare form. It is a gorgeous card. And then we got Sewagen. That is not too bad. I actually have one of these ones, but I do love to get myself a second gate guardian, which would be cool. Oh, we got Sagan, um, Sanga the, of the Thunder. Nice, we just need the, the wind one. A hero lives. Good seeker right there. So, not too bad. We got two hero cards and two gay guardian cards. And absolutely, I'll be sleeving these up because you only get four in this box and they do hold value because if people want rarity bumps, even if they are speed duel cards, they will offer you good bit of money for rarity bumps especially for elemental Hero bubble man that's the highest rarity i think you can get it as actually no it isn't you can actually get an ultimate rare for it but the ultimate rare is extremely expensive so the secret will be definitely your best one out of the three bubble man is the best secret to pull it out of than four so if you guys enjoyed it i surely did make sure you smash the like button as always subscribe if you're new to the channel Comment down below on what you think about the speed jewels. Do you think speed jewels are awesome? Do you think they're a waste of time? Do you think they're a waste of money? I don't think they are. They are great cards and good for good little support and a bit of quick fun. So with that being said, the people I'm speaking to you guys for subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! I love speed jewels so much. I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!